Hello, Matu Jimmy, and you're watching on Bill TV. Chill out. Mechanic Dada is a Nagamese Hindi film set against the backdrop of Nagaland that narrates the story of a mechanic whose life takes a challenging turn after losing his leg in an accident, plunging him into poverty. The narrative takes a heartwarming turn as he forms a deep bond with a young boy. Crafted by the talented writer Hikshe Sema, produced by Rebecca Changicha Sema and co-produced by Mrs. Alila Sema, the film is skillfully directed by Shiraz Henry. Mechanic Dada boasts a stellar cast featuring Kartik Karan, Yana Sakdani and Katu Sumi in the leading roles. Notably, it has achieved a significant milestone by securing licensing with a renowned US channel, underscoring its global appeal with an imp impressive collection of over 25 awards from various film festivals, the musical brilliance of Abuzar Rizvi. Complemented by the soulful vocals of N.K. Naga adds an extra layer of enchantment to this cinematic masterpiece. The film premiered at NIIFF Dimapur on December 14, 2022 and continues to captivate audiences worldwide. <laughs> Get up and come inside, or else you'll freeze to death. <sighs> Today we have 13-year-old Katu Sumi, an actor who plays a leading role in the film. So hi Katu, thank you so much for joining us today. Hello. How have you been? I've been really fine. All right. So tell us more about you as well. Uh, before we get into what the movie is about, tell us more about you. Uh, your, you go by the name Katu Sumi. Am I pronouncing yes, it right? Yes. So what is your full name? Uh, my name is Katu. Yeah. My full name is Katu. Katu only, okay. Yes. okay. So where are you studying? And tell us more about your family as well. I study in Hope Academy. Right. And I'm in grade 7. Great. I That's all. Yeah. So tell us more about your family. Also, uh, uh, do you have sisters or brothers? Yes, or I have two sisters, oh yeah, okay. and my mom. She's. Uh, I'm with my mom. Oh she's yeah. a single parent. That's why, I, I stay with her. Okay. Then, uh, what was your mom's reaction also when uh, about this movie? Uh, was she supportive? How was it? Uh, she was really excited. Excited. Yeah. Tell us more about uh, how you got into uh, the role also about uh, you play the role of a, a young boy who uh, forms a very strong bond with the mechanic, right? Is that yes. how, how the story goes? So tell us more about how you got into the role as well. Was there an audition or how was it? How did you get the role? Yes, there was an audition. Uh, there were some of my friends. Like, it was not thoroughly an audition, but yeah, I was the chosen one from there. Yeah. So was the audition in the school or was it somewhere else? It, w it was somewhere else. Somewhere else. Yeah. Were you always interested in acting or how no. did you develop uh, the interest? Uh, I was actually interested more in singing, right. but acting was also one of the part I loved. So, yeah. W when it comes to uh, schools or uh, functions, school functions and also church functions, do you also perform there when it comes to acting, drama, khan, skit khan, or how did you develop the interest? No, I really don't perform in school or churches, but I really love singing. Right, so, yeah. so now that you have been uh, in front of the camera, I hope you are comfortable, very much comfortable, is it, yeah. to have this conversation? Yes. Tell us more about the movie now, getting into the movie. When was the movie shot? And also if you could explain what happens in the movie, if you're allowed to. I mean, of course, you have to uh, keep some information to yourself. But if there's anything that you want to share to our viewers, tell us more about the movies, uh, movie as well. Uh, we started shooting at 2019. All right. But after COVID started, we skipped for two years. And then we continued on 2022 and then we finished it from there. Tell us more about your role, uh, the role that you play in the movie. Um, I was the little boy mm -hmm. helping the homeless guy. Who, he had no leg and it's not that I only gave him money and when it's not that all and I helped him with every way possible and I stayed as a best friend with him. 
So you were the support system for him yeah, throughout yes. his journey. So when you were when you started acting since uh, it was in 2019 and you're 13 now, you must have been I mean a, a lot younger, right? Yes. Then how did that go about? Uh, did you in that time when you had uh, when it comes to the movie shooting since it was in 20 I mean 2019 and then you had a gap for some years. Yes. Did you uh, practice or did you take acting classes or anything as such? No, I did not. Uh, the director, he gave me the script and I did all I could and I practiced it. Like, uh, okay. yeah. So how long would that movie be? Do you have any idea? Would it be how many hours? Is this a short film or tell us more about that also? It's nearly about two hours. Two hours. Yeah. So what were where were the places that the movie was shot here in uh, the movie is solely based in Nagaland is it, it was it only shot in Nagaland or other parts of northeast in the no, northeast uh, India also? Uh, we also shot it in the northeast the garden the garden. So how long did it, uh, did it take? It uh, it resumed in the year 2022, right? Or yes. 2023? 2022. 2022. So how long did it take? Uh, how many months or? It took. Uh, it took like four months, four months. yeah, and or maybe a little bit more. Well, maybe. Uh, how did you manage school and also at the same time uh, going around acting? How did you manage that? Was, was the school open about giving you leaves or how was it? No, uh, it's actually my mom. Yeah. She maintains everything like perfectly. Mm -hmm. She wakes up at four, she wakes up early and gets ready for the whole day. So when you went around shooting, f I'm pretty sure you went to uh, several places uh, f for shooting the movie, is it? Or was it just, you, you were just based in one uh, place? Uh, we went to three places. Right. Uh, one was Alabunaga's Musica, mm -hmm. and one was the Tea Garden, and then one was the school where we acted as a hosteler. Okay. Then was your mom with you the whole time, wherever you went, or how was yes, it? Yes, yes. The, uh, also, would you like to take up uh, acting as your career or what are your thoughts on that? Have you decided on what you want to become? Would you like to take it full time? Yes, I would love to. Yeah. And yeah. I would put interest on both singing and acting. Singing and yeah. acting, right? Tell us more about the experience uh, in the movie. What was your experience like working with, I'm pretty sure they were uh, very well known actors. Uh, I'm yet to watch the movie. Of I mean, it was screened in different uh, festivals, movie festivals, but uh, film festivals, but it's not out uh, yet, right? Or it uh, it's released on the OTT platform, right. like Buddha Singh, Private and Limited. And also Amazon Prime. Amazon Prime. Well, yeah. Then how has the response been? Have your friends watched the movie? Yes, I did. And then what I was did. the reaction of your friends and family members? They were really shocked like, of how I was in a movie. And did you enjoy the process, the whole process? Uh, tell us some moments where you enjoyed acting also there. Um, I actually enjoyed every part I had. And the most time I enjoy was with Kartik, mm -hmm. Sir Kartik. He he was the guy who I was helping. Mm. Uh, I had a lot of memories with him and the fun times I had. Maybe bec and also I think you spend most of your time on screen with him, is it? Because most of your uh, storyline went around. I mean, with him spending time with him. Yes. Right? Yes. Yeah. Then uh, and also the movie is in Hindi, right? It's. Actually, three language. Okay. It uh. was English, Nagamese, and Hindi. Hindi. Yeah. Then how did you? Are you good in Hindi? How did you uh, cope up with the Hindi dialogues? I'm pretty sure, since we're Hindi is not a language that we speak often, and of yeah. course you study Hindi in your uh, school. But are you good in Hindi? And how did you cope up with that uh, acting in Hindi? Actually, I'm um, not bad at speaking Hindi, but. Hindi was like s only in some parts mm -hmm. where I had to like s speak. Right, right. But it was mostly Nagamese and English. Only uh, mostly Nagamese and English, yes. right? 
uh, if in the future as well, if you get projects like this, is there any kind of role that you would want to play? Uh, I'm pretty sure you have also, before, before we go there, I'm pretty sure you also watch a lot of movies and you have uh, some certain actors or uh, actors that you adore, right? To, you look up to. So who is your, your role model when it comes to acting? Um, I really love Akshay Kumar. Okay. He really inspires me of how he acts and the emotions he shows. Right. So when it comes to acting, if you take it further, if you take it as your, uh, I mean, if you take it as your career, then would you like to be in movies like Akshay Kumar, like action-packed kind of movie, or what is it? What yes, kind of I roles would you? Yes, I would love to. And uh, I will meet Akshay Kumar one day. Yeah, of course you will. I'm pretty sure you did a... I'm yet to watch the movie, like I said, but I'm pretty sure that you did a, a great job, so I'm yeah. hopeful that you'll get to see him someday. Yes, thank you. <laughs> and uh, since our viewers are not much aware about the movie, right, uh, then just tell us if there's anything that... any other details that you would want to share? Would, uh, is there anything? I can just say... It's we can we could watch it on Amazon Prime, right. or like you have to wait for it to fully release. Fully release, yeah. so it's uh, just bit by bit, is it? Yes. And also, the movie has won a lot of awards, right? Yes. Twenty-five awards. Tell us more about that. Um, I don't know about that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I. Right. It's all dependent on my director about all the rewards. Mm -hmm. How was it working with the director? Was it nerve-wracking? Because I'm pretty sure we're not used to the camera and your acting. Was it tiring or how was, uh, how was it working with professionals at that point? No, of time? it was a very fun thing as it's my first time and I was really enjoying it. And what was the uh, most difficult parts for you when it comes to acting? Was it managing your time? Were you tired? Or what was the challenging part about being in a movie? It was actually all fine as my mom maintained everything mm -hmm. well and she prepared everything uh, like every morning she would prepare for a whole day. Mm -hmm. So like, I had no worries about it. Besides acting, you said you love singing, right? But yes. besides that also when you're not acting, uh, what do you enjoy doing then at home? I also love gaming, right. gaming with my friends and just hanging out with them like going to their house and like playing with them every day like that. Which kind of ga uh, games are you interested in? Uh, mostly adventure games mm -hmm. like um, where you could have a lot of friends and have fun. If uh, there was, you know, if there, there's ever an acting classes and you know institution as such, would you like to join that and uh, Ex uh, have more experiences like this. Yes, I will. Would, would you like to act? Yes. Now again, uh, would you tell us more about your one of the f favorite memory from the set? Is there anything as such that uh, you did this and it was fun? Any memories that will stay with you forever? Um, it it was a time when I I was with my director mm -hmm. and we we're having food. I mean. I was in the middle of the acting and I got hungry and they stopped it for me and I started searching for food and I ate it. Since you were the youngest in this on set, right? So did you get a lot of uh, love and affection? Were you pampered or how was it? Uh, yeah, yeah, I yes, I did. And there were a lot of people watching me when I was acting because mm -hmm. it was, they shoot it outside of the gate too. Because like, mm, the guy who I was helping was homeless and then from there the shopkeepers, they were also in the acting. Okay, so when you, uh, since Nagaland, of, we don't see a lot of people acting here, right? Then uh, si uh, now that you're saying, since you're out, did you feel nervous when you had people, I mean people would of course be curious, oh what's going on here and they would come and watch, right? Would, did it make you nervous? Did it affect your acting or anything as such? Did you feel nervous? Yes, I was really nervous, but mm -hmm. I kept my confidence up and I, I tried to not care about it. If there's any advice as such that you would want to give to uh, 
youngsters who would want to take up acting as their career? Is there anything you'd want to say to them? I would just love to tell them to have confidence mm -hmm. and appreciate whatever they get and whatever opportunities they get and appreciate it and use it well for their future. And now that you have fo uh, formed the relationship with all the actors, right? Do you s are you still in contact? Do you contact each other and update each other about your lives, your the uh, all the li actors and all? Do you are you still in contact? It's been a long time, but mm -hmm. yes, I used to be in contact with them. So when, it exa when exactly did the shooting end? Uh, I'm not sure about that, mm -hmm. but. I just know that it ended in 2022. 2022. Yeah. Right. And is there anything that you would want to, uh, like you said, it's out in uh, OTT platforms. Would you like to share anything to our viewers? Uh, do you want to ask them to watch the movie or anything as such? Anything, a uh, message to the viewers? Yes. Uh, Grandpa Hekshe, mm -hmm. he is the writer of the movie. Mm -hmm. uh, his wife too. And they're writing another like story to let me perform so they're saying I could perform again in their story so I'm just waiting for a chance for that again right. and would you like to request our viewers to watch the movie as well yes hi everyone my name is Katusumi and I'm playing a role in Mechanic Dada uh, the movie is all released on uh, OTT platform like Buddha Singh Private Limited and Amazon Prime I hope you ha guys have fun watching it and please please, please watch please. the movie and support me and hope you guys have a great day. God bless you all. Okay. All right. I think that's about it. Uh, thank you so much for uh, Katu for joining us today. It was a pleasure talking to you and like I said, we're yet to watch the movie but I'm pretty sure you did a very good job. We have seen the trailer so it, it was Thanks. a very... Uh, nice one so thank you so much for agreeing to speak to us today and i'm pretty uh, hopeful that you'll do good when it comes to acting also studies and whatever you're doing all the very best for your future endeavors thank you so much for joining us thank today. you so much that was hornbill tv speaking to upcoming star kartusumi that's all we have for now keep watching hornbill tv